So yeah, that was a short video showing how I make all my lollies. Ula lolis, ula lolis. Uh, tired. I was trying to get an angle that would capture, you know, the table and me. But welcome to another vlog, many vlogs. In this vlog, we are going to go through step by step how to make an ula lole. So ula lolis are pretty much lolly lays or lolly necklaces. Um, they can be used at you know, birthdays, graduations, and we're gonna make roses, ula lollies. See that? Making a mum roses, ula lolly. What you need for rose, well, to make ula lolly? Three or four simple things. So scissors, number one. You need chocolate or lollies preferably the ones that have the tag or have the extra wraps at the end you need thread and you need a ribbon so this is only for two dollars at Kmart this thread is normally two dollars at the two dollar shop this box of chocolates was fifteen dollars at Kmart and all together it should be under twenty dollars. So let's go. I'm gonna grab two lollies like that, and then you're going to grab your thread. And you're gonna firstly tie the two together. Oh, so not fixing there. So where the ends meet, that's where you're gonna tie it first. I used to do this all the time. So you're gonna wrap it. Wrap, 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 wrap. About three times or so. And then you're gonna tie it. You're gonna tie it. Just like that. So you tie it like that. And then that's the start of your ula lolly. You're gonna wrap, wrap, wrap. And then you grab another one. And that's how you so, you know, lots of people do it different ways. This is how my grandmother taught me. So, sui ah. The ula lole sui. Ah. Omoa. Play the filo. I don't know how you, what's the proper term for it. The easy ah. So, this is the easy way to do it. So you're gonna keep on wrapping it with the thread. And the so the key is to just like that keep on wrapping. You tie it around three times, four times, and then you go into the next. Ideally, you're supposed to go with colours that will alternate in a manner, so then it'll be more colourful. Most of people nowadays just use glad wrap to wrap the lollies or chocolates in. I personally just use this because it doesn't look as plasticky and it's not as tacky and plasticky as other normal lolly lays. Yeah, it should look like that. Hopefully it might get cut as well because the thread seems to be a bit laid out like that. Grab your ribbon. Just cut it in pieces.
There you have it, guys. Oh la lole. Okay, these are gonna be for special occasion. Right. She made heaps of these. One's enough. She really like it. It's always a good treat. It's always good to have at celebration. So yeah, that was a short video showing how I make all our lollies. And thanks for subscribing. Thanks for your support. And I will continue to upload more videos. Bye guys.